All right, next here at 5, a prominent Detroit chef who worked so hard to make a difference in the city of Detroit has passed away. Chef Max L. Hardy took pride in cooking dishes that excited the palate, but he served up much more than that, using his talents and gifts right, to yeah. make a difference in the community. Will Jones is live tonight. Will, you spoke to people who knew him well. Kimberly and Devin, this is where Chef Max spent a lot of his time here at the Detroit Shipping Company. I spoke with the restaurant owner who got to know him well here over the years. She says he looked out for her. Chef Max Hardy brought more to the table than food. When I say he's my son, I respect him a lot. Yeah. His Coupe Caribbean Fusion is located right next door to Genevieve Vang's Bangkok 96 Street Food at the Detroit Shipping Company. They were the first restaurants to open at the food hall. It's going to be tough because it's so close. Uh, the well-known Detroit chef passed away Monday. He was only 40 years old. I'm just kind of just stunned, man, that, that this guy's gone, man. He's going to be missed. I mean, he was a heck of a chef, man. Over the years, like Chef Max appeared on Local 4 multiple times. Last week, he stopped by Live in the D for Black History Month. Speaking outside the box, I, I mm -hmm. eat, breathe, sleep, you know, culinary arts. And Chef Max received many honors, including being named one of the top 16 black chefs changing food in America by the New York Times in 2019. We are very fortunate to have had, had him here in our city and to teach our young folks and to bring a, a part of his family, his life and his culture to the plate. His community work set him apart from other chefs. He broke his back for this community. I mean, the man would give his last. Detroit Shipping Company is closed today to customers because of the passing of Chef Max, but it is open for people who knew him to gather and share their emotions. We are live in Midtown. Will Jones, mm -hmm. Local 4. So talented and, and just such a force in the community. What a tragedy. All right, Will, thanks.